أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين الصلاة والسلام على رسول الله السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Welcome again to another episode of My Journey to Islam I'm your host Mizan Abu Isa and today I have with me Brother John. Brother John, how are you doing? You okay? I'm okay. Assalamu alaikum. Excellent. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullah. Excellent. So John, tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, I mean, how, how old are you and what do you do? I'm uh, 39 years old and uh, I'm from Paris, France and my family from Togo. From so Togo. Togo, Togo. So Togo is a West Africa border with uh, Ghana. So, Baiga, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Excellent. Uh, is there a lot of Muslims in Togo, or is it so? A there's a, a bit uh, Muslim in Togo, but the, the majority it's uh, Christian. So, so it's uh, it's not half half, but uh, more Christian in Togo. More yeah, Christian yeah, yeah more, more Christian okay. in Togo. Yeah. Excellent. Now, I take it you as Christian before you accepted Islam. Yeah. Okay, tell us a little bit about your previous life then in terms of Christianity. What, what was it um, that in Christianity that you know you started to question and you know, why did you eventually end up leaving Christianity? But uh, actually I was not, uh, I was not practicing uh, in a Christianity. So that's why it was missing something in my life. Mm -hmm. But uh, I mean, I didn't go to the church. Uh, I read uh, I read the Bible, and afterward I was a bit confused about the Trinity, mm -hmm. all kind kind of kind of thing. So that's why, since uh, maybe 18 years old, I was attracted by uh, by Islam. Yeah. Yeah. So you became Muslim at the age of 18? No, or? later okay. it, it took me it, it took me it took me uh, maybe. Uh, 50 years before, before <laughs> to become Muslim. Mashallah. So when yeah. did you actually finally take the Shahada and when did you actually finally become a Muslim? So it was only, it was uh, two years ago. Two years ago? Yeah, two years wow. ago. So, so not, not too long ago then? Yeah, yeah, two Excellent. years ago. So um, I came from France first in, uh, in uh, I went to Ireland and uh, like I said before, it was missing something so at this time I start to go to the church, but I give up straight away. So afterward I give up because, like I said, I was confused about, about uh, Christianity. So I came afterward to uh, to uh, to UK to Birmingham, and uh, I start to uh, to uh, to uh, investigate uh, Islam. So. I went online, I got some uh, brochures, so I started to, to read uh, about Islam. And, uh, so you started doing your own research? Yeah, 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 a lot of research, yeah. Mashallah. Yeah. And did you have any particular people helping you and, and advising mm, you? Or not you just all on my own. No, yeah, yeah, on, on, yeah, on my own, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, no one helped me for, for that, yeah. Excellent. Okay. Yeah. So, so eventually you found that missing thing in your life, yeah. you found it within Islam. What was the appealing factor then? What was it in Islam that made you think, you know what, this is the truth? The truth, it's uh, one God. So we have to uh, worship uh, one God. And uh, I always believe in my life there's a God, mm -hmm. but I, did, I didn't have any concept uh, about the God. But when I, I started to inve uh, investigate uh, Islam, and uh, I knew, after a while, it was the truth, so, so, yeah. yeah. Inshallah. Yes, because the, the one God factor appeals, obviously, because there is only one creator. Yeah, only one course. creator, yeah. So, excellent, excellent. so for me, it was clear, it was easy. It was very easy to, to accept uh, Islam and then to practice it. Islam, it was easy. Yeah, it was something normal for me. But uh, I think it was a time for me because bef before, I was not ready for, uh, for, for the truth, I was not ready. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. Oh, yeah. Okay, before you became Muslim, mm. 
What were your views of Muslims or how do you perceive Islam? I have a good view of, uh, about Islam, but I mean, like I said before, I was not uh, interesting or ready for, 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 for Islam because I remember before I want to become Muslim, but the fact we have to pray five, five salat a day, mm. for me it was too much because yeah. I was so busy in my dunya, so it was too much. So that's why I always want to become Muslim, but uh, I think I was not ready for, for it. So. Yeah. so I have a good view because I have a, a, a lot of friends around me, Muslim people from Morocco, Algeria, from Sene Senegal. So, so I knew a bit about, about uh, Islam uh, before. Yeah. Okay. So and how would you say Islam has changed your life? Uh, Islam changed my life. Um, give me the guidance, discipline, and uh, respect about myself and other people. So it changed a lot. And, and uh, I'm peaceful now. I'm peaceful. So, so Islam, uh, I think it was the best thing in my life when I took my shahada because I can see the big gap between uh, before my life and now. Mm -hmm. So, so it changed a lot, a lot, a so lot. you have a lot of inner peace now? Yeah, peace in my heart, yeah. yeah, yeah. Inshallah. Yeah. I, suppose, I suppose that's the main thing a lot of people kind of look yeah. for, that internal peace. I think so, yeah, because we can have all money in the world, but if you don't have peace in your heart or if you don't feel uh, like, uh, you know, yeah, you, you get this connection with the God. Yeah. Yeah, this connection yeah. with God, that's a very, very important yeah, thing. Yeah, I think yeah. you lost. Yeah, you lost. Yeah. Just for the benefit of some of the viewers, because they may be asking, you know, what is this connection with God that Muslims keep talking about? I mean, if you just like to explain to the viewers, like how, you know, our connection with God, we know we worship God, we don't actually go and worship something to get to God. Anymore, no, you know? straight away, straight to the God. Mm. So, I mean, uh, we ask for the God straight away. We, we don't, we don't, we don't, we don't have any intermediate. It's straight to God. Straight to God. So some people God. might think that we worship the Prophet Muhammad or no, ask the no. Prophet Muhammad to get to God. No, it's straight to God. So that's that's why for me the Islam is clear and easy to understand and to practice because it's it's about God. That's it. Yeah. So Inshallah. it's very very clear. Inshallah. And in terms of um, uh, any support you received, I and mean, especially from uh, Green and Masjid, mm. I mean. Was there anything that you benefited from the masjid at all? Yeah, of course. Uh, I mean, before I used to live with uh, one friend of mine. He's not Muslim. So, so after a while, someone t t told me, I was told, yeah, there's some room upstairs, so you can rent uh, the room upstairs. So I came to you, I remember. I came to you, asked you for the room. You, you give me the opportunity to, to get the room, and it, it, it helped me a lot because, I mean, for Fajr, for Salat, to pray and to be around the Muslim people, it's uh, very beneficial for my team. So, yeah. So, so, and it helps being close to the Muslim Yeah, to, the to Muslim be close. And, and, yeah, Muslim and well. what is very important, yeah. Because you can be on your own, you have to be around Muslim people. Yeah. yeah it boosts uh, your, your deen. So, Definitely. Yeah. I, I just, there might be some viewers watching this who may be new Muslims. Mm -hmm. And it's just expanding upon what you just said it's important to be around other Muslims because yeah. some people may not be um, around many Muslims. Yeah. If you could just explain for the benefits of some of the viewers, what's the importance of being around other Muslims? Because for me, for my part, every day I, I learn something new from Islam, uh, from people or if I go do my research, of course I learn as well, but from people or something, something I don't know and they explain me. So, so I think here yeah, it's very important to be around, uh, around the Muslim people and see the character, the behavior from some Muslim people give you some influence to you. So you, it can be good. Inshallah. It can be good. Inshallah. And do you feel that bond as well with, with all the brothers yeah. around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like uh, one family because I'm in on my own. Yeah. So I have no. My dad and my, my mom live in Paris and with my son and my brother sister. So I'm on my, my own, but I don't feel alone because with the Muslim people around me, I feel like uh, I have a big family around me. So, so that, that, that is a good thing. So. Mashallah. Yeah. 
Now, if you used to give some advice to some people, because there might be some viewers actually watching this mm. right now, and they may not be Muslims, mm. but they're thinking about Islam, maybe the 50-50, yeah. should I become Muslim, should I not yeah. become Muslim, what advice would you give to them? So my advice would be, first read the Quran, and try to look to Islam, the religion, but not to uh, Muslim people. I mean, what we see in the TV and what we can see sometimes on the news, the bad things. So, so the, the, the main thing is to, to, to learn about Islam. Islam, what means submission, so learn about Islam. Make some research about this Islam. Yeah. Excellent. So. Alhamdulillah. Okay. And finally, just a few words. How would you summarize Islam? What does it mean for you? Like I said before, religion of peace, you know, give you the, is the purpose of life. Before I was lost, like I said before, I didn't know first how to worship God and I was lost. I, I did some, some bad stuff because I was ignorant, mm -hmm. but, uh, but, uh, with Islam, it gives me the, the guidance, so, so, so yeah. Allah, yeah. Allah, yeah. Peace, mashallah. Okay, I think with that we'll have to wrap up. Yeah, but, okay. Brother John, may Allah bless you. Yeah, thank you for coming yeah. on today. No, you're welcome. Okay. okay, and um, for the viewers, thank you very much for watching again. Alhamdulillah. If you'd like to know more about Islam, please visit us or email me actually on info at greenlanemasjid.org. Okay, if you just type question from Mizan and I'll, and I'll try to get back to you inshallah. Okay, Jazakul Khair. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytani r-rajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim.